What's going on guys? So for today's video, what I wanted to do was talk about what I believe to be the absolute most important part when it comes to any sort of health and fitness gains that a young kid or young athlete wants to make, and that's gonna be consistency. Guys, in my opinion, everything works, as long as you're doing it consistently. So you could have the best, most perfect workout for your body type and your goals and your age and any sort of limitations you might have. If you're only doing that once a week, you're not gonna see the results that you want as if you were doing, let's say, five times a week, just push-ups, sit-ups, and squats in your room. A lot of times I think people get way too caught up in trying to figure out what's the best way, and they overanalyze everything with all the YouTube posts and Instagram and the TikToks and way too much information out there that they just end up doing nothing. Just start. That's why I'm such a big proponent for body weight stuff. A lot of the kids and clients that I have and people that I make contact for can't drive, maybe 13, 14, 15 years old. They can't drive or we're, we're in the middle of this coronavirus outbreak where a lot of people are stuck at home and don't have any sort of weights. Body weight's gonna be your best friend in a situation like that if you are stuck at home either during this or if you can't drive or don't have access to a gym, anything like that, you can still get a ton of work in at home. Guys, when I was 13, 14, 15, 16 years old, looking back on it, I didn't really know what I was doing in the gym. I had kind of an idea. But for the most part, I didn't really know what I was doing when it came to sets and exercise pairing and weights and reps and all that type of stuff. But I just went to the gym all the time and I was eating healthy all the time. And looking back, I know that's why it worked so well for me. It wasn't because I was following some crazy program that I bought online. Instagram wasn't even a thing when I was in high school. YouTube was barely a thing. I wasn't following anything special. I wasn't doing this specific exercise. I just went all the time. And when you're younger, that's what matters. You guys respond quickly to whatever sort of work you're doing. So if it's deadlifts or cleans or you're doing explosive this or body weight that, whatever it is, as long as you're getting into the gym or doing some sort of working out consistently, and I'm talking like four, five times a week, that's really all that's gonna matter. Now, you do have to be patient, all right? I get a lot of messages saying, what's the fastest? How long until? If you're 15 years old or in high school, you gotta be patient. Just wait. It is gonna take a little bit of time. Regardless of if you guys do respond pretty quickly to things, just be patient. This is a long process, okay? Take your time. Again, it's only gonna work if you're going all the time. You can't be working out one or two times a week or taking three months off because you're in season. Yes, you can change your workouts up a little bit because you're in season, but taking three months off is gonna pull you right back to where you started. If you're only going once or twice a week, we're probably not making that much progress. So remember, even if you can't get into the gym, let's say maybe it's only two or three times a week you can get in, you can get in there and then you're stuck at home the rest of the time, hit some push-ups, hit some squats. I did pull-ups and push-ups and sit-ups and ran around my block all the time when I was 15. Get on that stuff. It's going to add up if you're doing it consistently all the time. Guys, thank you so much for sticking around. If you made it this far, enjoyed the video, please give it a thumbs up. If you like this type of content, make sure you are subscribed to my channel. And as always, make sure you're following me on my other uh, social media accounts where I'm pumping out daily content for you guys. I will see you next time.